Hey everyone, it is October 17th and this is Mondays with the Mayor. Hope you all had an amazing weekend and are ready to tackle this week. Let's talk about what we have going on. First and foremost, children are back uh, from fall break, so kind of keep an eye out for them uh, while you're bebopping around. I know uh, sometimes we can miss them, get distracted on the road, so please, please be careful for children going to school, coming home from school as well as, of course, buses. So keep that in mind. One of the things we got going on also is early voting has started for the for basically the state of Arizona. So if you would like, you can come down to the Civic Center from 9 until 4, um, Monday through Friday, up until November 4th. And you can cast an early ballot, you can get a replacement ballot, um, but you just come to the third floor. There's a Yonkai County employee, election employees down there who will be able to help you out, answer any questions you have. Again, 9 to 4, Monday to Friday, up until the Friday before election, which is... November 4th. What we got going on, we have next week, or October 29th, will be Dump the Drugs from 10 till 2. So if you have a bunch of uh, prescription medication that you don't need anymore or perhaps are expired, you don't want to dump them down the toilet or throw them in the garbage, you bring them down here and have them safely disposed of. So again, October 29th, Prescott Valley Police Department, Dump the Drugs Day. What we got going on, um, also for those of you uh, may or may not know, but Prescott East Highway is uh, being worked on for road construction. Road construction will be going on until basically the middle to end of January. So it's a partnership with the Amplify County and Prescott Valley. And uh, I promise you, Prescott East Highway is going to look completely different next time you see it um, come uh, 2023. So that's exciting news for everyone that uses that road. Of course, we got Halloween coming up soon, October 28th, which is a Friday. Here, in Pre or here at Town Hall, um, at the Civic Center, basically uh, theater on the green area, from 4 to 8 p.m. is Haunting on the Green. So it's just a great opportunity. We're going to have bike rodeo, police bike rodeo, costume contests, fa face painting, bounce houses, pumpkin painting, scavenger hunt. It's entirely free. You bring your children um, and just have them enjoy. Let them, uh, let them wear their costume as many times as possible. So again, October 28th from 4 to 8 p.m., right here at the Civic Center, haunting on the green. I promise you, your kids are gonna love it. And then with that being said, we then transition over to Halloween, which is Monday, October 31st. Safe trick-or-treating will be done over at Finley Toyota Center. So um, basically it's a little indoor, outdoor type of event. We have a lot of uh, community members and businesses that are they, they have booths and they set it up. And again, it's a free event and the kids kind of parade around showing off their costumes and of course getting treats. So check that out. That starts at four o'clock and goes from four to seven. Uh, it's a huge event. If you get there early, you get there late, no big deal. The line moves fairly quickly. And again, your kids are gonna love that. Uh, and that might be all you need for trick or treating that day. Who knows? So October 31st, Finley Toilet Center. Wrapping things up with our dad joke folks. They're not bad, they're dad jokes. Here we go. What kind of street does a ghost like best? A dead end, of course. <laughs> All right, guys. We'll see you next time.